Hey, how's it going, friends? My name is Angel Alex, and welcome back to the channel. We are back with some more of The Witcher 3. And of course, we're back with some more of that side quest grind. Now, at the end of last stream, I actually upgraded the house for the first time, which looks beautiful. Look at this, my goodness, we got our armors. Uh, we got that painting that we got from that dude. The place is looking good, it's looking good. During that stream, we also took on the Wine Wars quest, so if you haven't seen that, definitely go check that out. It took most of the stream, it was very long. A lot of fighting, my goodness. But today, uh, let's see what we have in store as far as side quests. Um, I'd say let's go ahead and start off with Night for Hire. Greetings, Knight. I've heard reports of feats of great bravery. Thus, please accept this reward for your dedication, sir. Alrighty, um, coin to pay the knights. Wait, Can't help we... but be curious, but where do the funds for those payments come from? How do we start this the quest Ducal here? The treasury, of course. Her illustrious highness, Anna Henrietta, assigns great value to bravery and selfless patriotism. It is her standing order that any knight may receive a wage. <coughs> Pardon me. Financial compensation for his dedication to defending the Duchy's internal security and order. Um, am I supposed to talk to this guy? Am I Wouldn't talking mind to glance other at your books. Dude? Ones you're willing to sell, that is. Maybe I'm not talking to the right guy here. Okay, there you go. It updated. Complete the contracts you took on. Okay, I didn't even know I took on contracts. Wait, let's see here. Does it change? Do they actually show... No, not here. Contracts. Guess not. Let me see. Let's check the map, actually. Wow, so we got a handful still. Um, Should we do that? All quests? Maybe we should. We should do that all today. Let's see. Yeah, I guess we could do that all today. It'll probably take up most of the episode. But, um... Who knows, maybe it'll be interesting, you know, knowing the Witcher, and we need the money, so... Oh shit, oh, okay, I see what we're doing here. Oh no, 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 let my friend go! Bitch, 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 bitch. <laughs> yes, sir! Go around the rock, man, around the rock. Whew, there. But Under me blind. I would be gone if not for your aid, comrade. Alright, well, that's another one throat. completed. It is the Let's have a look around. Ooh, yes. All the monies. I'll take all the monies. What's that noise? All right, that's one down. Let's head to the next one. That's it, Roach. All right, guys, here we go. Another one. Whoa! Oh god, that scared me. Oh man, I hate these, I hate these things with a passion. Ooh, they're very angry today. Ow! Quinn, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Okay, I'm gonna die, 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 Whew. Angry. Oh, 
hate those things with a passion. Already cleared out the area. Let's loot around and then we'll head to the next the thing hand to move. Alrighty guys, here we are at the next location. Looking like we got some bandits. <laughs> that was a little gruesome. These guys with the bows and arrows first. Ow. Ow again. Ow again. Alright, let's try this. Why didn't I get any help from that? Give me, give me some space, yo! Give me some space! Bro, what? I chose Icky! Bro! Ready, ready, ready! Bah! Oh! Oh shit! Back up! <laughs> oh. You and me, sir. Oh, that works. Ooh. <laughs> Gotta hit my high note for the day. Another area cleared. Let's, uh, of course, look around and then we'll head to the next one. Alright, guys, so the next location is actually one of those uh, castle icons on the map that you're gonna have to clear out a base. It's a base. And uh, we're gonna have to clear it out completely and kill the leader of the base. So this is gonna be a challenge. But uh, let's do it. I've actually been in here before, but I've just kept these guys alive because I was just grinding, <laughs> killing a, a couple, selling their their weapons, coming back, killing a couple, selling their weapons, coming back, that kind of stuff. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> that works. Alright. Since we have time, let's have a nice save here. And uh, we'll loot we'll loot around later. Let's just finish these guys off. Uh, hey guys! What's up? Alright, I know there's gonna be some archers. Ow. Hit archers with a passion, bro. Ah, 
Oh, get back. God, there's so many. Oh, fuck, they got dogs too, bro. Oh, my gosh, my gosh, my gosh. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, fuck, shit. There's a lot of boys here today. It's like zombies, man. It's like a wave of zombies. Line again about that, you know. <laughs> so stressful. Hi, <laughs> right, doggy. Ow. Ow. Oh fuck! Shit. Okay, we're coming down here now. Come on, guys, see me. Thank you. I guess we're coming down here now. Come on, boys. They do so much damage. Ah, oh, dude, come on. Alrighty, I'm trying this shit one last time. Let's dance. Oh shit. Oh, okay. 
What the hell, dude? How do they take me out with one hit? That doesn't make any sense. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna have to save this quest for uh, a stream for sure because it's taking a lot of time just to get through this castle here and we still got uh, a lot of other places to take care of. So I'd say for now, let's go ahead and do another side quest and do the Hunger Game. I'm not even sure- oh, Marlene is the girl that we rescued. All oh, right, right. Can I- can I just talk to her? Let me see. I don't know if it'll trigger our actual quest or if this is just like checking I do up. not know how I will ever repay you, Witcher. Don't expect to be paid. Hope you're feeling better, that's all. Oh, yes, I feel my strength returning thanks chiefly to Barnabas Basil's care. Horrible ordeal you endured. Glad I cut it short. Yes. Years of suffering. You know what was worse than the hunger? Watching my loved ones, my children grow old and die. All my family's long gone now. The last of my kin perished decades past. I fear I've nowhere to go. Uh, go to town, sir, and you can stay here. This is a big house, big estate. You can stay here. Truly? I could never infringe so on your hospitality. Yet... Yeah? After all I've suffered, the years of starvation, I've but one dream. At last, to prepare food that fortifies, nourishes, to delight in the tastes and smells of spices. To sit at one table with others and eat. Hmm. Don't see a problem if that's your dream. You could help Barnabas Basil in the kitchen. Eating his meals. You know he's not a culinary virtuoso. Nothing could make me happier. Thank you. No, thank you. House could use a woman's touch. I've <laughs> one other thing I'd like to tell you. Many years ago, my father assembled valuables for my diary. I never wet, so they remained unclaimed. These baubles are no use to me now, but to you, 
Well, perhaps let them be a token of my gratitude. If you wish to find them, you must go to my old home, to Trastamara. The dowry lies hidden in a barrel in the cellar. There are several barrels. You must give each a knock until you find the right one. Do just that. Thanks. Um... Where'd you learn to cook? I'd never expect someone with your past to feel drawn to the kitchen. Do you fear I will cook in your home as I brewed as a white? <laughs> Counting on you having slightly better taste as a human. Of that, you can be sure. I loved cooking, even as a child. My gran was a true master in the kitchen. Her spit-roasted oaks was famed throughout the land. Spit Thought you roasted. were a lady, owned an estate. Do you mean to say a woman of my rank should have had a cook? You're right, of course. And I had the best of cooks. But I devised the dishes myself. They only prepared them. All right. You sure you don't feel lonely out here? I cannot say yet. Too little time has passed since you freed me of my thrall. But somehow, for now at least, I do not feel drawn to the city. To others. Visited others' homes as a white. Yes, but ever at night, when all were asleep, I went in search of spoons. Remember, you can always change your mind. Decide you've lived here long enough, just say the word. I'd never wish to seem ungrateful. And I'd never want you to stay against your will. Oh, it's such a sweetheart. Okay. See you later. Take care, Witcher. And remember, you always have warm food awaiting your return. Oh. Alright, well we can go, uh... Get her belongings, or I guess I don't even know what they are, what we're collecting here, but apparently it's for us, so I'll take it. <laughs> Alright, guys, we're back here. All these creepy spoons. Nah, this was actually one of my favorite quests, not gonna lie. A part of the DLC, at least. But, um, alright, let's check down here. Knock on some of these barrels. Ooh, down here. Holy shit. Might want to look around some. There's a lot of spoons. Jesus. Right, here we go. I hear noises. Knock, knock. Hmm, nothing interesting here. Knock, knock. Nothing. Full. Knock these. This one's full too. Oh, this one. Full. Uh, I think I was like, is there more? <laughs> Can I not knock on these? There we go. This one's full too. Nothing interesting here. Okay. Hmm. Strange. Oh. A gold stick of joy and crown. That's awful pretty. It'll look great in the house. Ah, bet. So weeds. Alright, next let's go ahead and do a contract for old time's sake. What the golly blasting devils are you doing, man? What plague? An unfortunate turn of offense, that's all. Get back to chiseling. If we don't deliver that hat on time, the infestor will twist my plums off. Plums? Is that what you'll tell Emil's widow? That a cow crushed him and it was an accident? This, sir, is a grave matter. It requires a specialist. Some mage or warlock. Or a witcher. What happened here? Just eavesdropping. Look, it's that witcher who's come to town. Maybe he can do something. An exorcism or the like. <laughs> we should ask how much coin he'll want. All Saw of it. your notice. Got a problem with a cow? Fear a plague, is that it? Yes, indeed. And a horrid one at that. We've asked the gods something true. We have. 
In Zedekania, they've sent a plague of locusts, then of frogs. With us, they skipped right to raining cows down on us. Enough! Enough! No need to so panic! Come, Master Witcher, I shall divulge to you the matter at hand. Alright, let's have a chat. Yes, an unfortunate matter indeed, to be crushed by a cow. A true shame, Emil. He was a good worker. I told them at once there had to be a simple explanation. But that lot, no. Right away they started in screaming, PLAGUE! Demanding higher wages for hardship. Poor working conditions, you see? They ruin me, the blotters. Mm. My job is to figure out why a cow fell from the sky. That it. What That's is this, too. chicken little? The thing is, since none bother to clear the cow corpse, some filths overrun the other pit. We fear to venture there. Not surprised. Cow, where'd it come from? What kind was it? Why, the ordinary spotted kind. Nothing unusual. Its corpse rots in the other pit, sends out its stench, and a meal lies right beneath it. Will you tend to the matter and take on the contract? Uh, of course. Um, what exactly are you doing here? What exactly is going on here? Construction of a statue of the Prophet Lepiota. We're carving it. Not all at once, that is, but piece by piece. A pious infestus revived the project after years of neglect. He's engaged all nearby quarries in its completion. And we would be on schedule were it not for the incident. Please, Master, will you look into it? Need to know more about this accident. Anyone actually see what happened? No, but sounds there were. Osterf had just gone to see how Emil was getting along when suddenly we heard an ear botching boom. Moments later, something smashed into one of the cranes. Doubt it was the cow that hit the crane. Probably true. At any rate, come morn, we ventured out to sea, but the vermin drove us off. With that, all work came to a halt has remained so since. Master, tarry no longer, please. Will you take on the matter? Uh, let's talk about my reward Need first. to talk about my reward before I decide. Ah, time for a good hackle. So how much would you take? Let's see what we got here. 300? Let's try and go for, uh, 335? Fine. But that is the sum total. No bonuses or gratuities on top. Understood. Sassy. All right, I'll look into it. Fine, I'll look into it. Might be a botched portal, but I doubt it. Lapiota reward you with progeny aplenty. I shall keep an eye out for your return. All righty, I'll take a look then. Examine the cow carcass. All righty, take that if you don't mind. Okay, um, this way. All righty, whoa. All splayed out. Let's have a look, I guess. Must be a meal. Workers mentioned him. Poor guy. Unlucky as all hell. Right. Now where do I start? Crushed by something heavy. Skull base is cracked. Fresh tooth marks. Necrophages. But they got to him after his death. Won't learn anything else from the body. Tissues crushed in places. Must have fallen from quite a height. Oof. Got sliced open. Hmm. Not much blood, so it happened after death. Heart had already stopped pumping. Tooth marks. Small ones, though. So necrophages left him clearly. Sure sniffed out their feast fast. Deep claw wounds. Spread between talons indicates a draconid. A wyvern, probably. But these wounds weren't the cause of death. Cause of the accident. Got it. All clear now. Cow died when it fell from a great height. Draconid must have dropped it. A youngster probably trying to get the cow back to its nest, but it proved too heavy. Emil's bad luck to be standing right underneath. Oh, okay. And then there's the crane. Investigate the crane? Okay. Blood. Draconid must have.
have hit it pretty hard. Dropped the cow, then probably tried to steady its flight. Got hurt in the process. Good. Should be simple to track down. Alrighty. Let's have a look. Can't see. Here we go. Traces of draconid blood. Barely perceptible. I'm on the right track. Just keep looking. Started bleeding heavily. Wound was more serious than I thought, looks like. Here we go. Up here. Let's, let's save real quick. Hmm. Oh, boys. Smell like sour mash. It must have been a little bit scary. Oh god. I got. made a mess, then moved on. Potatoes. Paw prints. Crawled through here. Clearly too tired to fly. <laughs> here we go. Mm, second draconid landed here. A larger one. Waited for the smaller one to heal. Then they flew off together. Should be easy to track. Smaller one was still bleeding, luckily. Alright, let's keep looking. Oh, we got a dead cow. Hmm, another cow. This one's been dead a lot longer, though. Slizzard did this, too. Can tell by the claw marks. The burns must feel safe here. Trail ends here. Hmm, been up here already. Might want to take a look. Just to be sure. Let's keep looking. Mm -hmm. Had it right. Slizzard stole the cows. Well, killed them already. Maybe now I can get someone to pay me for it. <laughs> Good thing I incinerated those eggs back there. Now to collect my reward. Alright, yeah, I forgot. I did this probably off screen. I, I, I actually don't remember. Maybe I did do it on screen. But, um, yeah, I cleared this area out. Got the power, um... Place of power. And I burnt the eggs, so I think we're all in the clear. Let's head back and get our reward. Well, have you learned how that cow came to fly? <laughs> came to fly. Yep, cleared everything up. Yeah, you can get back to work. And it wasn't a plague of falling cows. Did I not say so from this start? A weight off my chest. So, what was behind the animal's plummet? Young Slizzard flying over the quarry dropped it. Was trying to get it back to its nest. Food for its mother and siblings. Probably heard the last of the beasts. Burned the nest, eggs, everything. A praiseworthy precaution, but as I said, I can only pay you what we agreed. I simply haven't any more. It's all good. Yeah, take this. And I thank you, Master. Of course. I'll take what I can get. Got paid for basically doing nothing, just for looking around. All cleared up now, right? No gods, no plague, just the dragon, but it's gone too. We're to pay Emil's widow compensation, and that will be that. So, why do you still stand there and wait, man? Back to work, chop chop! <laughs> and I've a notion suspicious workings are still afoot. What became of the builders who were to put the statue together? They were due three days back, yet there's still no sign of them at Ardesto. They were crushed too, I'm certain of it. Or eaten, or, or locusts got them, like in Zeregania. What's this rubbish you spout now? The architects wrote they would arrive a week late with a large shipment of marble from Metana. 
for the Prophet's beard. So stop flapping your yaps and get to work. Hmm. Weird. Allow me to walk you away, Master. Truth be told, I lied. But I cannot have them panic again. The workers he mentioned, they've indeed vanished. Come see me later, I shall divulge to you the details. Okay, y'all just got so many problems, man. Alrighty, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode there. I know there wasn't too much that happened this episode as far as side quests, but that uh, Night for Hire quest actually took up a lot of my time. I really tried my hardest on that quest. But uh, that's something I'm definitely gonna have to do on stream. But the next video will hopefully be more story related side quests. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't yet. Check out all the links down in the description if you're interested in the gear I use and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.